Well, if you head out to the wilds, you'll find more than 25 threatened or endangered species. But we're not all talking cute and cuddly. The wilds is also the home to the first insect on the endangered species list, the American burring beetle. It's one of the greatest decomposers, and it was nearly wiped out, but it's now making a comeback. They used to be found all over the eastern portion of the U.S. and now their populations are limited to just a few states. Because we don't have a brood stock here in Ohio, we go to Nebraska and we collect beetles. We're permitted to collect 60 beetles or 30 pairs, 30 males, 30 females. We've conducted our interview about the beetle outside because, um, as many of you may know, I have a, a fear of large bugs. And this apparently is a large bug. Like, how mm -hmm. big is this beetle? Um, it's about uh, a little over an inch. The moment of truth, we had it inside. In here. Oh, God, they're everywhere. Okay. Yes. I'm going to stand right here. Oh, that one just moved. <laughs> so it's awake. That one's awake. Just want to let you know. There's one that is, leg is moving. Yeah. Um, okay. So I'll pull out um, a male and a female. You, you're going to do what? I'm gonna pull one out as long as you're comfortable. <laughs> so these guys are cute, really cute. Yeah. yeah. So they, the little antennas are doing it for me. Yeah. Those are adorable. So they, yeah, it's a cute, it's a good looking beetle. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now you're leaving that one unattended. Yeah, it'll be fine. Okay. She's barely awake. Okay. <laughs> so they're not so, bad. Yeah. They're not bad. <laughs> Do you want to hold one? With some I'll gloves? Hold it. I'll hold it. Okay. Yeah, Whoa. sure. I'll hold it. I'm gonna place them in your hand. Okay. And then. If it's he moving. walks, <laughs> all you have to do is put your one hand in front of the other. Okay. Um, yeah, you can't get up on me, bro. <laughs> well, that was fun, but then it was time to get down to business. So we just got these in from Nebraska. Oh, that's a big one. So I'm just going to put her in our little okay. breeding arena. We put in the male and, you know. And their uh, grandchildren are basically what we will release next year. Okay. So when we do a release next week of the individuals that we have in here, these yeah. are, this is the second generation from last year's Nebraska beetles. Oh, so these are going out. These are going out. Because that's the ultimate goal is to have them breeding in the wild, get a population large enough uh, that can sustain that. Yeah, so we were like, do we put it in C-17 <laughs> rating on that video? And it looked like they liked each other. Hopefully they were successful. Yes. Um, it's a very interesting beetle. You can learn more about it at the wilds, but the conservation efforts there mm -hmm. are just tremendous. They, they really span, you know, all different life forms. Yeah, exactly. For big and small, right. all that's important for this very fragile ecosystem right. that we're dealing with. Exactly. So yeah, it's great to see. And next uh, week, we'll be introducing you to the hellbenders. Okay. A face only a mother can love, but I thought they were pretty cute. So that's yeah. coming up for you next week. That's next week.